Hey, how you doing? I'm here with my puppy, Luna. And Luna's a little tired. She had a busy morning. She had a taste of squirrel and a rabbit. So she's resting. Maybe you have a pet. Dog or a cat or maybe fish. And if you do, you understand that, well, there's certain things you gotta do. You have responsibility, like you have to make sure that they're fed and they're watered and take Take them outside, you gotta play with them, let them know that they're loved. Today we're learning about our relationship with God's other creatures, animals. God made us, God made them, and God wants us to take care of them. And they're part of our world and our lives. How about we go visit some of my special friends again and find out a little bit more about our relationship with animals. Hey, we're back here at the Geiger Family Farm. And today we're going to talk a bit about humans and animals. And let me share you something from Psalm 104. All creatures look to you, O Lord, to give them their food at the proper time. When you give it to them, they gather it up. When you open your hand, they are satisfied with good things. When you hide their face, they are terrified. When you take away their breath, they die and return to the dust. When you send your spirit, they are created and you renew the face of the ground. Hey, chicken, just sliding under. Oh, that was pretty easy. Oh my goodness, it's a brown one. <laughs> I think it's all right, Kenny. I need to get him up. Oh, yeah, you do. <laughs> they harass me all the time. <laughs> so I actually have some questions for you. Oh, okay. Okay. Is <laughs> put a star in this? Hey, how's it going? We're here at Geiger Family Farm with some goat friends. Um, I've named them this and that. I'm here with the goat lady. Hello. <laughs> now, I will tell you that the things I know about goats, mostly I learned in cartoons. And I have a feeling that it may not have been telling us the truth. So if you help me out with a few of the questions that I have, that the things I learned about goats in cartoons, um, just you know, tell me true or false. Uh, first one is uh, that I learned goats eat anything. You always see them eating an old leather boot or a tin can in the cartoons. False. 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 They oh. will nibble on things to learn what they are, but they won't eat them. Okay. Speaking of uh, their eating habits, they often show them like as great lawnmowers. Just put them out and they just gobble up the fish. True. Oh, true. Okay, they'll, so get rid, they'll get rid of your weeds. They love poison ivy. Good you know. <laughs> um, well, the other thing is they always tell you to go smell that. I'm going to stay here next to them. I don't really notice them. Let's take a goat. Males smell bad. Okay, so half and half on that one. <laughs> um, the other thing is, is that they don't tell you like the, uh, the like goat milk and goat cheese is kind of really icky tasting. Oh no, it's really good. Mm -hmm. It's really good. Um, and it's very healthy. Um, the last one that you know you always had the classic thing where you'd, you'd turn around and you'd bend over and all of a sudden the goat would grab you in the butt. Um, true if it's a buck. <laughs> the, the male will do that to you if you're not watching. So a little of everything. So, as you know, part of God's creation, we have a responsibility to care for the animals, right? Correct. And so what kind of benefits do we get from the well, goats in particular? Well, um, these are meat goats, so we get um, good, healthy meat from them. Um, like you said, they are good at um, lawn mowing. They're, uh, if you put them in the woods, they will eat a lot of the uh, the weeds, vegetation that um, is not a healthy vegetation for a wood. Uh, and they're just fun to be with. <laughs> <laughs> 
You get a lot of good byproducts from goats. Nice. Leather, um, milk. Of course, now I can't think of any of them. <laughs> oh, you get goat, goat cheese, right? Goat cheese, mm -hmm. yes. Well, thank you very much. And we're okay. glad that, uh, to, uh, get to meet our good friends and uh, part of God's creation.